How easy is it to set one of these 5G dialers up? Couldn't be easier. Um, every unit comes with a load of QR codes. One's for the live screen, the other one's just for a view screen. So the view screen is really useful. You can just scan it and then it comes up with the current settings. But I'm just, this is the live screen one. I'm going to scan it. Okay, scan that. Click on the link. That's going to take me to... Oh, just uh, turn my phone up the right way. Okay, that's took me to, for the, to the live screen for that particular unit. So just going to go on the users, click on new user, put my name in, Michael. And then user details, I'm going to put my phone number in. Okay, and also I want to be in charge of the system, so I'm going to put myself as um, uh, admin, call and text. That means this phone number is going to get, it's, it's, got, it's got access via the phone and also it's got text and calls coming to it. Um, I'll put an email address in as well, just a simple one there, and I'll give myself full access. And what will happen then is that when I save it, like I'll do now, I'll just click on save. Okay. Um, what that's done now is it's also sent me an email. It might appear now, actually, because it's Gmail. It'll probably appear on my phone. But anyway, oh, there we go. Look, I got an email. Um, the email, if I click on the link in the email... That, again, takes me straight back to that live screen. So you don't need the QR code after after you've done that. You only need the QR code once, and then you can use the email links to get back there. If you don't have your emails, you can also text, get link to the phone number it sends you, and that'll get you to the live screen too. That's it then. That's all the setup work you really need to do as a minimum. Uh, so I'm going to connect input one to ground, just with a piece of wire there. Instantly, you can see that the input shows as going low on the portal. Um, and then we should start getting the text messages and calls. Here's the call. Hello, so just answer that call. Put the speaker on so you can hear it. The alarm is sounding. Just put the mic closer to the phone. The alarm is sounding. Okay, it says that four times by default in four different voices. Um, we also get the text message and an email if, you've, if we've uh, added our emails too. Um, obviously, when we disconnect it, we can also get the other message. So we get the alarm is sounding there. We get the second message which says the alarm is stopped. If we just go back to the um, live screen, you can see it's changed again because I pulled the wire out. We have a quick look at the signal. Uh, it says we're on 4G, Vodafone 4G. It's actually a LTEM that, and we've got a good signal. If you want to top up, at the moment we're still using our, our allowance that we get when we uh, get a brand new unit. It comes with at least you know 10 to 20 calls and um, free allowance but if you ever want to top up you just click on um, select the amount it goes up in five pound increments so we can like keep going say four times five is 20 quid and um, we'll just leave it at one times five for the moment click on top up and then it takes you to the shopify shop where you can just buy a top up Um, one other thing you can do is you can actually change the messages it says, obviously. Uh, you can change the message it sends you when it, when it connects to ground or when it starts and when it disconnects and, you know, and it, when it uh, stops. So it's really pretty obvious stuff that. Um, it'll read it out as well. Whatever you write in there, it also reads out. Um, so that's pretty much it, really. Straight out the box. That's all you have to do. Uh, literally just connected some power to this, powered it up. No messing around with SIM cards or anything. It's just, it just works and, and that'll work as it is uh, for the best part of 10 years. In 10 years time, you'll have to top it up. Probably 12 quid, 12 to 20 quid. Um, that's it, yeah. Dead, dead good, really good. Um, really pleased with these products. The 5G one especially is uh, particularly good. Um, we have another video where we demonstrate it working in the Liverpool Underground. It's, uh, it's the only option, really, for an alarm dial. Okay, thanks for watching.